Hey, homies, what's up? It's your boy, Johnny, a.k.a. Dirty. You know what day it is. That's right. Wednesday. Influential Women Wednesdays, where we take a closer look at women who have changed the world, changed the sciences, or just been really bad at it. Really? Now, let's get into it. And as always, if you like these, uh, just leave a comment, leave a like. You like what we're doing with the channel? As I said, we will be growing and rolling out new videos and new items every week. Next month, we have a couple more surprises coming up in store. Every other Friday is Field Trip Friday. And uh, yeah, let's just get into it. Brandy, if you could, please roll my intro. All right, ladies and gentlemen, please allow me to introduce to you Dr. Jenny Reeve, who, beginning July 1st, Jenny Reeve will be taking over as the Dean of Engineering at Cal State Long Beach. Reeve leaves San Jose State University, whereas an Associate Dean of the Charles W. Davidson College of Engineering. She established academic advising programs, developed innovative curricula, such as the Cisco apprenticeship within the industrial technology major, along with service learning program engineering projects in the community service field at San Jose State University. The external relationships provided intellectual and financial resources for San Jose State University for lab development, lab development, student scholarships, conference sponsorships, student success initiatives, and programming to promote diversity and inclusion. Reed received her bachelor's in 89, her master's in 90, and her PhD in 1995, which means that within five, hold on. Oh, five six years whatever time span that was i was gonna throw out quick numbers it's six it's like six it's like six years within that six year span she has been she was way more productive than i think i've ever been for like a week so that's bad <laughs> off the bat right all these degrees her bachelor's master's and PhD came from Stanford U University in mechanical engineering. And mechanical engineering is pretty dope. I mean, it's pretty dope. My brother's a mechanical engineer. My sister and I are mechanical engineers, and they okay people. I'm not I'm not jealous. Whatever. <clears throat> Reed received her bachelor's in 89, her master's in 90, and her PhD in 1995. Meaning, she is just bad ass. Because to knock out all this in about six years, seven years, somewhere around there, I'm not good with numbers. I don't want to count right now. I have my shoes on. I can't really do that much counting my shoes on. Don't, don't judge me. You're the one watching the video. Re received her bachelor's in 89, her master's in 90, and her PhD in 1995. So within a five to six year span, she went from no degree to a PhD with a master's and a nice little pit stop at her bachelor's all in between. Meaning, you really, that's productive. That is badassly productive. That is productively badass. All her degrees came from Stanford University in the field of mechanical engineering. Her interests include renewable energy, thermal management, because you gotta manage those therms, and student success strategies, particularly for engineering and STEM majors, which engineering and STEM majors are kind of a 
make me somewhat stressful. And um, to know that this is someone coming in with a focus on trying to create the best environment for these students who are obscenely stressed is a nice little touch and a nice change of pace, if you will. Because in education, a lot of times, it's just grind, 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 get the assignment done, do everything, do everything, get this one done, get one done, get on to the next project, on to the next test, on to the next set of notes. Just keep it going, keep it going, pump, pump, churn, 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 churn. And you get a lot of burnout that way. So, having a dean of engineering who has not only taken it upon themselves to learn what the best strategies are for these students to learn and you know maintain that knowledge, but also develop programs and manners and strategies for these students to be successful is just kind of mind blowing. Yeah. Yeah. Provost Brian Jersky said Rees Vision of a modern and diverse college of engineering will provide invaluable industry and community connections for all the students and faculty for years to come. And I have to say, I agree, because just reading about what this person has done and what they bring to the table has your boy thinking it might be time to go back to school because I'm like, hmm, these graduate degrees look pretty good. Now I know there's someone here that cares about students. Ah, caring about student success, you say. I might have to come back and get a master's. Because, you know, your boy was out. I was just out. Ugh, I'm never coming back. But, hey. Dr. Jenny Reed. Got me thinking it might be time to go back to school. Might have to do a little learning. All right, homies. So that's it for today. Jenny Reed, thank you. Good luck at your new position at Cal State Long Beach. And I wish you, your students, the faculty, and the college the best and the utmost success. All right, homies. Peace. Hey, fam. So just real quick, if you like what we're doing, don't forget to share the video, subscribe to the channel, like the video, hit the little uh, bell icon so you actually get the alerts. And um, yeah, feel free to leave a comment down. If there's any school you want us to look at particularly, anyone of interest you want us to talk about, let us know, just leave a comment, send me an email, chelloscience.gmail.com. And uh, yeah, stay curious, stay safe.